Eagles. Welcome to Eagle TV. I am Ames Dean, and I'm joined by my teammate, Scarlett Thompson, to bring you the Eagle announcements. If you're planning to submit a pumpkin for the annual pumpkin decorating contest, you should know that the deadline is coming up on October 18th or next Friday. Make sure you are not carving your pumpkins. Happy decorating. Throughout the next couple of months, Ms. Teresa will be hosting a middle-level library lunch activity during your lunch hour. That cal the calendar that has all the events is posted throughout the middle school hallways and in the Eldo Library website. If you want to participate, make sure that you sign up the week before the event that you want to participate in. This is for middle-level students only. If you don't yet have Eldorado gear, then you should then get yours today. It will be available on Eldorado website. Don't forget to show your spirit on Friday by wearing your new gear. On Tuesday, October 15th from 4 to 5.30 uh, at Wildflower Park, our middle-level lesions will be hosting a middle-level kickball tournament. All you need to bring is yourself, your game face, your sneakers, and some friends. And your parents can come along to watch the games go down. Snacks will also be provided, so come and join in on the fun. And just a reminder, this month is October, so it's um, National Bowling Prevention Month. Now, wait, what? Now on to the next. This lesson is so boring. I wish we could do something fun for once. Yeah, but we do need to pay attention. Otherwise, we might miss something. There's a summative assessment on this lesson, and that's for a big grade. Yeah, I guess you might be right. Wait, what's that over there? Huh? What, what are you talking about? I don't see anything. Look harder. Oh, are you talking about that? Where did my pencil case go? I don't know. Did you have it with you? Uh, yeah, I did. I just got my highlighter out of it. Where'd it go? Huh, that's weird. Anyway, what were you saying? Oh, yeah, are you talking about that poster over there? Yeah, it's hilarious. Oh, let me read it. Bro, oh, how is that funny? Where did my notebook go? It's gone. Please don't interrupt me while I'm teaching. I'm, I'm sorry, Mr. Lotsworth, but my notebook and pencil case just disappeared. It's like there's a ghost stealing it. It's so ridiculous. But what's so funny? <laughs> one stealing your notebook and pencil case. Hey, what? Those cost a lot of money. Give them back. Stealing is not permitted in my classroom. Get to the principal office now. But, but Mr. Did he ask? Get out now. Edge, where is my stuff? Under my chair. I got all the stuff on riddles and jokes, Mr. Lots of work. Speaking of riddles. Guess who's back? Back again. First, let's start from with the riddles from last week, which I will now reveal the answer to. What has to be broken before you can use it? The answer for that one is an egg. And what has a head and a tail but no body? The answer for that one is a coin. Uh, I bet. I got you with one of those. I mean, come on, those were really good rules. Would you like to hear some jokes? Just kidding, there's only one answer. What kind of cat should you never trust? A cheetah. <laughs> Why are elevator jo jokes so good? They work on so many levels. <laughs> what computers have the best voice? Adele. <laughs> Uh, you see, that last one is funny because Adele is the name of a singer, but it also sounds like a computer. It's so funny. Okay, now it's time for our riddles, to which the answers will be revealed next week. I'm heavy forward, but backward I'm not. What am I? I still don't know. What goes up but never comes down? I still don't know. All right, well... Now that my riddles are done, that's all for Eagle TV. Bye-bye.